separate piece in their entire home and they wouldn't be without it. So if you've been curious about it, I encourage you to tune in for the 10 a.m. presentation. All right, we've got fave number five, and we're gonna have a few different faves from Sporto and from some really cool footwear, like you see right here. Now this is your suede booty. It's got that moccasin look, and, and actually we've got, uh, if, if you like the idea of a moccasin look, but you don't really want the booty of it, you want more of just a traditional moccasin look, we do have that one coming up, just to let you know. But if you love this, comfortable, flexible feel, then definitely go for fave number five. So we have it for you in, this one's called Chestnut. We have it in black. Here it is in, um, is this one our, this one is our Tawny? Wow, okay, so Tawny is more of the, the berry colors that we typically see here, you know, in this time frame in the fall. So this one's called Tawny. And then lastly, we have it for you in Excalibur. And Excalibur is gonna be your gray color. I know that they went, you know, a little bit esoteric with the color names. <laughs> so if you need help or maybe you forget, the gray is Excalibur. The tan color is Chestnut. The black one is black, thankfully, and then the berry color is called tawny. But let's kind of, I will tell you, the chestnut is the most limited, and I think I would say it's likely because it is the most kind of reminiscent of moccasins as, w as what we know of them. But these are all genuine suede. These are from Sporto, and Sporto, you know, are the cold weather experts. They, when it comes to cold weather, you don't typically see, we don't typically offer Sporto in the spring and summer because those are hot weather seasons. But when it comes to cold, Sporto knows how to do it, and, and they're some of the best. This is all genuine suede. I flipped it over and I already unzipped it because this is the way that you're gonna get in and out. They have this really great uh, tassel here that's also suede. On the inside of this boot, do you see it's this feel of shearling? It is a faux shearling on the inside, but this just means soft, it means warm, it means comfortable, and this uh, feel and look of shearling, it is faux shearling, shearling, is not only around the front of your leg and your ankle, and your heel, it's also underneath your feet as well. You're standing on this exact same material. So that means you don't have to wear socks, you don't have to wear stockings, you can if you want to, but if you, even if you don't, your feet are gonna be nice and warm and cozy. And they just look so good, I love that look. Jennifer's joining us this morning and she's wearing these with her skinnies and a great little top and it's just a, a nice alternative to always throwing on whether maybe it's a ballet flat or a high heel or a tennis shoe because you've got comfort and cushioning all built in to this really cool look. You're gonna order these in sizes five and a half to 10, 11, and 12 and you have medium and wide widths on here. And the moccasin look has been very, very popular. It, it really started to come back last fall season. And what I like about these though, is that it doesn't, it's, it's a hint to moccasin, but it doesn't look like, you know, like a costume. You know what I mean? You know that it's warm and cozy. You've got this really cool, I think it might be easiest to see on the uh, chestnut color. You've got this really cool design pattern that's stitched in in this silkened cord design going all the way through. But it's not too much. It's not overpowering. You also have your whip stitching detail, which is this that goes all the way around. There's that tassel once again. You've got also that contrast stitching that goes around to the back of this little booty here. You have more of a driving style outsole the way that it comes up. Because you know when you drive in your shoes, if you ever look at shoes that you wear all the time that you drive in, the right shoe is always worn, <laughs> is always why you're worn out. Don't look at the shoe while you're driving. Just look at the one <laughs> that you drive in. The right side heel is always worn out because you're going back and forth to the brake, to the accelerator. So it's nice that you have this extra outsole detail here, more of like a driving shoe. Here's that grip on the bottom. I always like to show you the grip on the bottom because the grip, particularly at this time of year, is very important. When you're walking on wet leaves and maybe a little bit of dew on the ground or, or you know, maybe it's been wet, you know, kind of raining, you want that grip. And then 
flexibility. You know how I feel about this. If a shoe does not flex right here, it's not gonna be as comfortable as it should be. And this is your opportunity to get a really cool moccasin booty style. Now, tune in for a full presentation of this coming up at 